Hi guys, welcome to DWM. If you're in trouble, first thing you do is go to arconlixd.com and check out any of the desktops you want to learn from. DWM is a particular tough one because it's not your regular desktop. And there is a question online about the D menu. Well, use the search, right? D menu and see what you get. Add DWM to it and see what you get. And there is indeed something already more or less similar, changing the look of our DWM and it will go for, um, where is it again? It will change the D menu at some point in time. It's gonna rise the look, change the look of your uh, menus. And so read this, um, follow this, because DWM is not your normal kind of um, desktop. It's actually an application. <clears throat> yes, you're running an application. Am I? Yes, you are, DWM. It's located here, user local bin DWM. So whatever you're gonna change, and that's cool, if you wanna try to change Arco DWM, this is our headquarters. This is where the changes will happen Keep track of all the changes and then build it. And making DWM is make and sudo make install. But you have to open it, of course, inside the headquarters. So open a terminal in here, say make and say sudo make install. I've now overwritten the application user local bin DWM. So whatever you do, change it. Now, knowledge is everything and tools are as well everything. Melt is there to compare. Rip grep is the application. And RG is the command. And this is where D menu is located. Somewhere in there, there is something about the D menu or something in there about, I don't know, melt or, or, or a terminal or something, right? Every instance is shown to you. The same goes for the, the platinum searcher. It's with underscores, the platinum searcher. We better just type it. I just type often platinum. That's enough. So we have the platinum searcher bin and it's coming from the AOR. Same thing. PT, D menu. Use the tools that you have. If it's not installed, install it, right? One installed PT D menu. So everywhere, this is where it's somewhere it's mentioned. Now there are two D menus, it's a little bit tricky. There is the Super Shift D. This is our look. There's also our keyboard shortcut. On many desktops, 22 of them, on many desktops, this will just kick in super shift d and i don't care about the menus that are on those desktops because firefox is so easily run just by super shift d i can get to any application i like and i know the names right if you don't know the names okay fine now melt is not starting that has another reason but let's include it anyway you need to make sure none of these guys are running. So you need to kill everything and then it will run for sure. So on tiling window managers, if you close your tiling window manager, sometimes melt, if not always, uh, runs. If you clean quit it, it's okay. But if you just dirty quit it, <laughs> so to speak, then it stays there and you have to kill it yourself. So. D menu is in here. Let's start with that one as the easiest one. D menu super shift D. D menu run. And the guy that um, asked the question just wanted to change the pixel size. So six, uh, sorry, 20, <laughs> 14 to, uh, was it 14? Yeah, to 20. Okay, they can make it smaller as well. Control save. Reloading the sexy hotkey demon, as we call it, or the simple X hotkey demon, is super shift S. And then super shift D again, 
and now it's bigger. Agreed? It's a lot bigger. If you're not agreeing, Control S, Super Shift S, Super Shift D, I think you're agreeing. It's bigger. So anything that you change in here, colors and all that, just fine. That's our D menu. But there is also, we kept it in, a D menu from um, DWM. And it has another keyboard shortcut. It's Super P. Super P is how it normally looks. This is DWM look. Same thing, right? <laughs> it will work as well. Same thing. It's D menu, but it's another look. That's all. So we kept it in and it's here. D menu font, monospace, size 10. And if you want to have that also bigger, for example, let's exaggerate so you see the difference. Control, save, reboot. The user says and nothing worked. It doesn't work. DWM is broken. Always think if something doesn't work, it's me. I'm doing something wrong. Then the next step is, ah, let's Google, <laughs> right? That's the only way to learn is not thinking the machine is wrong. No, I'm wrong. Okay. And then you go to the website of articlingsd.com and at some point in time you see, oh my God, I need to build the package. This DLM is an application. This doesn't help anything. It's not written away inside user local bin DWM. No, it isn't. So we've, we're going to change the def h, but also the config h. I keep them always the same. Config h and def h, I believe it's, uh, which one was it again? One of those needs to be changed and one of those is going to really be used to make, make it, but I'm too tired to figure it out. <laughs> I'm just going to go for, let's do that again missed it let's do just make that's one thing and sudo make install and now it's written away user local bin dwm and a super p is not showing anything bigger okay what if we do super x log out and then since the desktop is is an application then run the new dwm super p oh my god right now we've changed both dwms this is the one from dwm and uh, sorry we've changed the d menu super shift d is the other guy big enough for you or not nice enough for you but this is how you change it and that is the one i'll include in the video that history 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 was here i think well, have a look. I'll add it to the videos that this is basically how to do it. There was something about D menu. Control find D menu is going inside 12, changing the look of your DWM. If you can change the color, you should be able to change the, the size. But okay, an extra video never hurts anybody. All right, cheers, have fun.